Hello everyone, my name is Noah, and welcome back to 7 Days to Die Alpha 16. Uh, it's been a little while since I've last recorded, but uh, other than that, not really much has happened. Uh, still, uh, I've been able to uh, get a lot of my stuff from uh, this location and uh, down here, and I have gone into to this uh, location. Now, I was able to get back to here, open the safe, and get all the stuff. And as you can see, I'm pretty full. So, don't really have uh, that much yet. Did not really find anything. I did find some uh, more forged steel, so... Or I don't know if I had that from last time. It's been a while since I've been on this world. I've also uh, took down the workbench. And uh, apparently, you don't get the workbench back. Well, you don't get the workbench anymore. You do get you get parts from it, but they're actually pretty good uh, parts from it. As you can see, I got mechanical parts, forged iron, and some wood. So, if you can actually get the uh, actually uh, like a break down the workbench because you do get a lot of nice stuff from it. Ooh, can I take that? Yeah. But uh, now it's time to actually head back to my my base in hopes that uh, I can start uh, making it a little bit better and I've also uh, bought my a lot of my skill points but I think from last time oh no I didn't I'm actually gonna buy the workbench so I can make my own and apparently if I can see what do I need I need 25 forged iron 20 mechanical parts one wrench one hammer and 50 wood okay so the hammer is not really that big of a deal because uh, I have the forged iron and it's easy to make. The only the biggest issue that I think I'll have right now is the wrench. Because I either need to find one or I need to make one. And I did make another one. Uh, as you can see, my wrench is at kind of a higher level. Because uh, I did make one and it was a base of 150. Then I combined the two. But, apparently, now that, uh, apparently that means I'm going to have to make a new uh, wrench. Ooh, is that better than what I have? It is. Alright, there we go. And everything is taken here, so I just need to head over there. And, like, I'll also try to, like, to avoid the derelict area because it's the uh, spot that uh, it's not really good. I don't really need the miner's helmet on anymore. Ooh, some gunpowder. Oh, ho one shot at him. Scrapper for scrap. I'm actually full on arrows. How much arrows do I have? A hundred. I actually make like another hundred because I have the resources. So that'll be good. Also, getting all these eggs is a really good thing to get because I do would would like to make a uh, to uh, make. I'm trying to remember what it was. Bacon and eggs, that's what it was. Couldn't quite exactly remember it. But uh, that'll, that'll be good if I'm able to make that. You know, I'm going to stop at the trader. It's a little bit of a risk. But that's something I'm willing to take. I do have bullets. I can't believe I searched all this. Now, hopefully, I do not run into a mine like last time I walked through here. And I will have to find a, a place to hunker down for the night because it is the night of day seven. So, I might need to find a place in town in order to, uh, like, survive 
if I find a bunker house, then I think that might be the best uh, area to spend the night. But it just all depends. So hopefully there won't be too many dogs in here. Yeah, I need these sports bags I would like. I already have uh, something better. Can I assemble that? I believe I can. Oh, no, I can't. Uh, it is worth a pretty penny, though. Alright, what I'm going to do is actually take uh, this glue. Make some duct tape. Take those. Oh, there's a dog right there. For some strange reason, I can't get a single hit. Alright. He's dead, at least. Now, at least I'll get quite a few uh, experience for uh, killing those dogs, because you do actually get quite a bit. But, like I said, I don't really like traveling in the derelict area, not only for the mines and snakes, but it's mainly the dogs. The dogs is what I fear most. But I would like to kill as many zombies as I can on the way there. Ooh, I should take that. Because I would like to level up. Because also I have one of those treasures out and I would like to put on Treasure Hunter because they do have a lot of times really good items in them. Like, they can have possible, uh... Oh. Vulture. Because they do have, uh, like, uh... Guns, bullets, like just a bunch of good stuff. In fact, how how much am I on Treasure Hunter? Actually, none. So I would like to put a point on that. Try to get this kill. Missed. Okay, there's another dog over there. Ho oh, ho, that was a nice shot. Oh, another pistol. There's a lot of dogs up there. I would like to collect that pistol. Oh, thank you for another first aid. What would be smart is to actually swap this money out for this first aid. Now I'm just trying to see if there's anything I don't need, really. Uh, I can scrap this because I have something. Take that pistol. Actually use the crossbow. Not meant to do that. <laughs> All right, take that. Don't move. Come on. Oh, come on. That should have hit. Come on. All right, I'm going to go this way a little bit. Oh, ho, ho. that was a good shot. You just gotta, you just gotta, it's all in the timing. Take you out. I do need that, because I am hungry. I'm just supposed to just, like I said, be very careful of where the mines are. Like, I remember when I uh, was going over the video just to see where that mine exactly was that I ran over and apparently it was actually really well hidden I definitely would have not noticed it uh, when I was just getting the stuff from the uh, bag but literally it was there it was if you can see if you pause the video just as I come out of it it was just blue it was one of those candy tin mines it was not like one of those regular mines you see around the military bases so it was unfortunate. Ooh, is that crawler? More kill. Oh, I'm pretty uh, tired. But when you're on a certain difficulty, it's not that dumb. What you got, Jimmy? Make it snappy. I gotta take a crap. All right, I'll make it snappy. Just give me some monies. Uh, get the, give you the money. I don't really need a sawed off. I don't really find it that good either, so I'll sell that. Uh, how much would you give me for that pistol? A thousand. 
Now, it does have bullets in there, but I don't have the pistol book yet, so I just gotta sell it. He's got a good hand, good, uh... Alright, so we've got auger. Ooh, that's really tempting. Leather gloves, painting. A good, a decent, uh, leather chest. I mean, iron chest, sorry. Does he have any books? Doesn't look like it, because that's what I really like right now. Got a blue shotgun. I don't even have close, to, cl close to the uh, thing. He's got a mining helmet, but I already got one. Yeah, he doesn't really have anything. Oh, you want a guarantee, huh? Well, maybe you should try Shamway. <laughs> I forgot I have all this uh, in here, so I need to. Uh, make all this like all the forged iron I can just to get my use out of it I'm only gonna get seven pieces because I only have seven pieces of clay so I'm just gonna get that really quick also get some uh, materials out and also since it's day seven I think there's another airdrop So I would like to go for that. Here's some water. Eat the scrap. He didn't even have any forged steel, did he? If you break it, you buy it. Resources. Just trying to think, because that's mainly what I technically want. And he doesn't have. A wrench. Get the hell out of my store! It's for real customers. Oh, and you're saying I'm not a real customer? Well, thanks a lot. All right, now I just gotta head down here. All right. I'm assuming there is an airdrop today. Not exactly. Not exactly 100% remember, because. Oh, yep, there is. And it's a head. Thank goodness. Oh, missed that. Missed that again. Oh, missed that. Come on. There you go. Okay. Didn't get anything there. That vulture's probably coming for me. So I'm just gonna ignore him. Okay, it's good. It's in the green zone. In case you're wondering about that, is that I don't want to go too fast because you just go over like a cinder block or something and then you're gonna go flying down and breaking your leg. And being very close to the uh, Day 7 Horde, I would not like that. I got some cars here. I would like to wrench probably one of them. One shot at you. Scavenging is level 40. Oh, there's a dog! That's the wrong button I meant to click. What I would actually like to do is put some uh, put some points into scavenging, and a lock. I'll take it for right now. That's one thing I've. <gasps> That's a mine. That's a mine. Here, come on over. Come on over. I'm surprised. I'm surprised he didn't see me. Come on over. Come on over. That took so many more bullets than I thought. I swear that is a mine. Okay, guess not. <laughs> but I swear, I swear that was a mine. That scared me pretty good. There's a random house. You know, find a schematic in here. 
And it's one of the ones with a bookcase. Easy points here. Sleeping zombies equals free points. Uh, ooh, what is that? Drunken disorderly? That's actually a bad challenge. I'm probably not gonna do that one. Any up here? Yep. That should be it. Sham sandwiches? Nothing. Oh, come on. Cooking pot. Get into this box. Hopefully there is something better in here. Working stiff. Ooh. Rebar frames. Not too bad. Any wrenches? I would like one to make the workbench. Well, at least my own workbench. Alright, scrap these chairs. I would usually scrap the rebar frames for iron, but I would actually like to keep them because I do want to get a concrete... Uh, well, concrete mixing really soon. Since they have that concrete mixer in the cave. So, that'll be excellent. Let's just take this putrid girl out. Hold still. Oh, not happening anymore. Hold still. Oh, I thought I missed her. At that time. Ooh, I would like to have bread. Because since I found that uh, chemistry chemistry station, I believe. Yeah. I can actually make uh, antibiotics if I need to. Since I'm close to that town. Alright, there's the drop. I would hope for something good. Oh, where'd your face go? Steel arrows, I like it. How much do I need for quality Joe? Eight points. Perfect. What do you got? Oh, ho, ho, look at that. That's probably one of the best airdrops I have ever gotten. Okay, I don't need this cooking pot anymore. Oh, ho, ho, look at that. A sniper. And also... Rocket launcher parks and mini bikes for dummies. Ooh, I like I like how I like it actually aims down sight. Let's test it. Missed. Two shots. Not really too good. How much damage? Forty damage. My crossbow actually does more than the sniper. <laughs> That's funny. Alright, I actually need to go that way. I would like that, but don't really have any room, so I'll scrap that. Now I gotta go to my cave. Oh wait, no, I don't have to go to my cave. I have to go to a town and find a building to actually survive the night on. Oh, and I'm a long way away. Oh, did not realize that. But at least for the next, uh, the next, uh, horde night, I'll have a mini bike, just in case when things go wrong. So, that will be good. Oh, but, oh my goodness, a sniper rifle, SMG schematic, mini bike schematic, rocket launcher parts, not really, and very few, uh, 762 rounds, but at least better than none because at least I'll be able to use the sniper but it's not really going to be too effective unless I get him right in the head I just need a oh, wait was that a that's a deer I thought it was a bear for a second the bears are actually much larger in this uh in this uh version Ooh, there's some, uh... 
took out her head. He immediately came over here. Oh, get over, get over, get over. Hee hee hee. Scrap that. And where did that departure woman go? I'll actually use those. Increase my medicine. And drink. Nice and good. You know what? I'm just going to make a quick uh, book it over here and then just quick book it to the town. Now, I'm very likely... Oh, wow, there's a mini horde over there. Don't have time for that right now. I know that's free points, but I just don't have time. Take another drink of water. Now, I'm very likely not going to record the, uh, the night, because, uh, oh, there's a wolf there. Attacking the zombie. I don't mind that. Now, I'm very likely not going to record the, uh, night, because it's just going to be me, uh, just, uh, up on a building and just, uh, hoping that it does not fall down. So, that's pretty much going to be me tonight. I'm not going to be crafting anything. I might try to get a few zombie kills, since I do have, like, 200 arrows now. But, it's very unlikely that I'll be starting killing some. That's the wrong cave. Oh, this is another cave. And apparently, it has a workbench right there. Well, that makes, uh, more, uh, parts. And here's my cave over here. Because it's just not worth it. It's just not worth, uh, coming all the way, uh, all the way over here just to craft something from the workbench. I would like to have it in the safety of my home. back. Hopefully no zombies. Got this nice hardened door. Can I actually uh, upgrade it again? Now that's very secured. That's probably like a 7500 door. Alright, put all this away. The night is already beginning. Uh, anything that I can stack in here. Got rocket, rocket launcher parts. Got a sniper that I do want to keep. Do I have anything else in here? Guess not. I guess I came unprepared. Alright, so I'll put this... Uh... There we go. Put the stuff in here. Got a lot of nice stuff. Put my bedroll. Yeah, why not? Right there. Got a nice spot for it. Duct tape. Now, I do have a lot of stuff that I do want to have with me just in case. Okay, that's a uh, look at its way. And I just want enough. That's going to last three minutes. Yeah, six minutes we should do. Alright, now it's time to get the heck out of here and make my way to uh, the town. Or else it ain't going to be good. All it is is just a bunch of sprinting back and forth. But, uh... Oh! First night of, uh... First horde night of, uh, Seven Days to Die Alpha 16. It's gonna be interesting. Just wonder how it's, uh... Gonna plan out. All just all depending on the building, uh... That I find. 
Now, I will go ahead and let you guys know that uh, I am playing another world, and it's basically a fun world that I do, that I'm just uh, playing on my own time. And uh, it is a difficulty uh, harder than uh, what my other, what this world is. Excuse me. Uh, but uh, basically, the game is already starting to get real in that world, and I'm only past the second horde night, which is day 14. So I think they really did um, up the ante for the difficulty in this game. If you want to. If you're trying to understand what I mean, is this that, well, I went to one of those military, uh, camps, and, like, you know, they have, like, the military guys, which are really tough to, uh, kill because of all the armor and everything, but also the zombie types as well, you gotta be very careful when you identify them, because, like, when you see them sleep on the ground, if you see a departured woman or, like, a cheerleader or something, oh, they're really easy to kill, you just need to sneak one with the bow, if it's something like a bloated walker, you might need a stronger weapon, like a crossbow, to kill him or something. I will tell you, the day nine, went to one of those military things, I found a feral in there. I'm not kidding. A feral zombie. On day nine. And, well, what do you, of course, uh, what does a feral do? Well... If you get, you get noticed by it, it will run towards you, and it's also really, really tough. So, I was able to kill it without dying. Didn't get any loot from it, unfortunately. But, like I said, it's just that <laughs> it's getting real already. Just, if that's what I'm expecting from a uh, day, uh, like the early days of uh, the, other, the, the other world... I just wonder what to expect uh, over here. Okay, this place we'll have to do. Gonna have to get inside, though. Be very cautious. Aw, oh, great. I'm not even thirsty. Okay, you know what? Once I break in, I'll be able to... Uh, take him out. Okay, while I do that, I should make some wood frames. All right, make this quick. Okay, dead. That's a crawler. Take my spike club. There we go, thank you. Don't have time to search them. I just gotta get up to the top and just in hopes that Missed. Missed again. She's gonna hit me. Oh, jeez. I'm not looking forward to this night. That's a bloated walker right there. Dead now. There's zombie in there. Don't see one. Quickly check over here. Alright, quickly want to check the bookcases. Don't really have anything in them. Up on the ladder. This is an iron ladder, so... Son of a gun! Oh my goodness, he scared me. Quickly get this. Alright, uh, where's my wrench? Better use one of these. Alright, that's, uh, secured. Put this down. I'm using all my wood, but... Alright, at least I don't think they can get up to me. Alright. Alright, that's going to do it for this episode, everyone. I really hope you guys enjoyed this. 
I'm just gonna stay up here and hopefully I just survive the night. So, anyways, thanks for watching everyone. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace!